What's poppin' everybody? This your boy Slick50 Back with another one for Poppin' Vinyl Before we get into this episode I'd like to thank everybody who showed up and showed out For the Toys of Our Youth auction yesterday, I mean, um, Tuesday That was beautiful, bro They they raised 700 and something dollars For the cancer, uh, Stand Up to Cancer And American Cancer Association Hey, bro That's huge I want to give a big shout out to everybody who showed up on my behalf. Whether you bought something or not, it's just the support is great. Shout out to ADD Gamer, everybody who uh, showed up and showed out on his behalf, and everybody who loves Toys of Our Youth, man. Hey, man, that's a great cause, and um, it shows that still humility in the world, you know what I'm saying, and empathy, and all those words that we need to still exist, you know what I mean? Your fellow man is your neighbor, you know what I'm saying, and not your enemy, bro, you know what I mean? So, not to get too, you know, sentimental, but I thought that was pretty dope when a lot of people don't. You know what I'm saying? My bad, y'all. I'm trying to get the mic and make sure y'all can hear me. Um, so, you get what I'm saying, though? So, shout out to y'all, man. Shout out to y'all. Um, of course, you know, if you're hey, not part of the group, man, don't miss out on no more auctions if you missed this one. Because I'm talking about, man, it was... Psh- you missed out. Just to say that you missed out. All right. If you didn't show up. All right. But I will say this. Make sure you're part of the Toys of, Toys of Our Youth group. Okay. Toys of Our Youth group. If you are not. Again. Guess what? You're missing out. <laughs> Period. You know what I'm saying? And if you live in the St. Charles. Slash St. Louis area. Come check out the store. You know what I'm saying? Right off Zumbel, right by the Walmart. You know where it's at. But let's keep it moving, though. We're not trying to make this one too long, and I'm very excited. I've waited and waited and waited. I have two of these, as you see in the picture. One I got put up. One's not better than the other for y'all. It's not different. But we got that guy right there. Let me turn him upside down. Yeah, we got the aerial view going on. You know what I'm saying? We got the aerial view. We do we do little tricks around here sometimes. <laughs> sometimes we do. So, peep it. You got the um, Marvel Legends series. You know what I'm saying? This is my first Marvel Legends. I don't get any, but it was anti-Venom. I was like, <coughs> I got to get it. I love anything Venom, period. You've been watching this channel. You know that. I'm telling you, it's like my primary pop section is, well, I got more movie pops than Venom, but that's only because ain't a lot of Venom pops came out. So I'm just saying, it's a lot, but not as many as movie pops. If I can show you right now, right over here, boy, you'd be like, wow, I got stacks and stacks of Venom. If you saw the video, um, what was that Tuesday's video, you saw some more Venom pops. I love my symbiotes. It is what it is. Also... I have this. We're going to open this. We're going to open this. All right. We're going to open this. I know most people are going to be like, what? They collect. Don't open them. I got to open this. That's why I bought two. All right. And I have a Marvel Select Venom. We're going to open soon. All right. It was a use. It's from, oh, my God. That's dope. Shout out to Dynasty, bro. Dynasty, you the man, man. You the man. I promise to God I wouldn't have it if it wasn't for Dynasty. All right, that's enough for that. Sorry, let me go. Anyway, we are finna open this and then we're gonna take it to a new full camera because I want you guys to see the full experience. So I'm gonna grab my knife and we're gonna start opening this thing up. Let's get it. I'm trying, I never opened one of these, so bear with me. But let me show you the back. That's what it looks like. Very poseable character, super dope. Maybe I can raise up a little. Fill the screen up. There you go. No glare. Super dope packaging. Looks like we're gonna open it up from the bottom. That's the side of the packaging. The packaging is dope. I'm sorry, it is. Um, you got the symbol up top. Marvel 80 years. Ah. There you go. Move your hand on. Move on. 
And you cut this white um, exposure down. We're gonna cut the exposure down a bit. Let me cut it down now. Is that better? Yeah, it looks like you'll be able to see a lot better. Versus that. You know what I'm saying? It jumps big. Yeah, let's go right there. Let me know in the comments if that was better or not. I don't know next time. Because I got more of these coming, man. Real talk. That Punisher was calling my name. I myself contributed contribute to the stand up to cancer. I sure did. I got a... Um, Oh, uh oh, uh oh, didn't want to do that. Almost missed the box up. Um, Black Panther statue. All right. And some Black Panther pops. It was crazy that I traded my Black Panther pops, but I bought some more for this, and I'm going to keep them this time. You no, know, just for memories. Okay, these boxes are not easy to open, y'all. I'm not gonna lie. This little slit don't want to come out. Is there a better way to open these? Oh, uh, maybe it's on the side. Maybe I cut that for no reason. Who knows? Bear with me, y'all. I'm opening it right here now. Because, um... The boy know nothing about these... Oh, oh, we got action. We got action. Uh oh, there we go. That you opened up, just wrapped around. Okay, come on out. Are oh, we doing this under the camera? No, no, hold on. Let me be quiet. All right, let's get it under the camera. Um. Okay, there we go. It slides out. I'm trying to remember this in case I want to put it back. About the key stand. Ooh, I didn't see the tendrils. When it's in the box, you don't see the tendrils or you don't notice them. But boy, oh boy, this comes off. Okay, the packaging, I'm digging it. I'm, oh yeah, there go the tendrils. We have gonna play with this. <laughs> Sound like a big old kid, don't I? All right, let me show you the tendrils first. Turn them around. There he is. I wish I could zoom in. It would be nice. Actually, I could. I don't. Let me see, guys. If I can zoom in. Yeah, I'm not going to do that. It's not going to let me. Okay, it is what it is. But, here go the tendrils in the second piece. I can tell you now, this probably is not going to go back in the box. It's a lot to remember where stuff goes. That's the tendrils. Let me move this exposure back up just a little bit. Are you serious? There we go. Tendrils, the white. We're not gonna worry about that. The um, guns are taped down. Let's pull him out first. He's in there, bro. So once you pull him out, he's not going back in. I'm being real. He's not going back in, bro. Nope. Well, you can get him back in there, but dang, man. I'm talking about... This is ridiculous. Ooh, he's super poseable. The head comes off, too. Yeah, these ain't no... Bro, these ain't no little kid stuff. This is some straight model... Let's play. You hear me? Like, for real, for real. Okay.
I want to give him in a standing motion. Wow. Down to his feet, bro. I'm talking about excuse the ashiness on my hand, but even down here, man, why is the exposure is really tripping, bro? Let me see what happens when I put on auto. Okay, it kind of, but not focusing. Oh, there we go. You know, I'm just doing myself. I don't ain't working good. All right, boom, better. Down to this. It's even. See yeah. it? Super dope. So you want to make him stand? You going to work at this? Like you really have to know about these type of figures. And um, cause I see now, like, and his legs is like, wow. What's gonna happen is we're gonna make him stand somehow once I get these guns in his hand. You know, we gotta put him on the record, bro. In the box, they seem a lot bigger than what, what I thought, but it's like the, I don't know, standard action figure size. Um, nonetheless. I can't get this guy to stand. And that's why they should come. You know what? I'm finna cheat, y'all. I'm finna cheat. I'm finna get. It got holes in the bottom. I'm finna get me a stand. <laughs> oh, man. I'm finna cheat. Because this dude don't want to stand. You know, like, he's posable. But for the video sake, I am finna get him all put together with guns and everything. Finally got him a stand. See that? But you got to mess with it. You know what I mean? So we just gonna lay him down, let you guys see him right there, whatnot. Pull the guns out. I think we're gonna go with the max. You know what I'm saying? These guys. The little handguns. I don't think we're gonna use those. You no, know I think we're gonna have. Let's do one of each. Cause like I said. He's not never going back in this box. This box might as well be trash. Um, you want to know something? He may not. We gonna keep the box. <laughs> never know. Never know in the future something may come out and I may want. Ooh, his finger goes on the trigger and everything, bro. That's like a big old kid, bro. But that's off the charts. You know, usually action figures, you know, they'll have where you they can hold the gun. You know, whatever the case may be. On some stuff like that. My dude finger fingers actually in the trigger, ladies and gentlemen. It's in the trigger, ladies and gentlemen. Do you see that? That is cool. That is cool. Oh, we got him to stand. He got that. Now you got him. Let's go and put the handgun in here. Want that trigger in there too. He got that finger on the trigger, man. Again, this is not a kid's type. <laughs> he got that finger on the trigger, man. His shoulder pads are like loose but at the same time okay I want him to shoot from the hip on this one. on him I'm posing I'm sorry y'all I'm just not talking I'm just all into it being a big old kid agent venom Boom, they should have where I put his guns on his hip, but I don't, I don't see no openings. He has one that's already on his side. They should let me put the actual gun that came with it on his side. Didn't notice it. See right there, there's a gun on his hip already. They should have that empty so you could put one of the other guns in there. Which would have been dope. You know what I'm saying? Let's put the tendrils.
Boy, I thought they could hold some. I'm, I'm unhappy. Oh, my man, I'm finna see. Let's see. Can the tendrils hold a gun? I'm finna see, y'all. We're gonna get this white bounce together, too, because I wanna. I want to see. Come on, man. Let me put them down. I want to see if the tendrils can hold. And what do you know? They can. Ha. <laughs> they can. <laughs> this is so dope. I'm sorry. It's been a long one video. I know this is not my, um, what am I doing? I, what am I doing? Let's just switch all the way over. It's a lot better, ain't it? There we go. And again, the white balance. What the heck is going on? Oh. All right. It's a little bit better. You out the way. As you can see, you can put him in his, right here in his tendrils, which I thought was pretty dope. Pretty dope. Okay, this one on too much want to hold it. It's holding it, but not holding it. You know what I mean? All right. I still want to find like a... um. Okay. So we got all the guns. It seems that you only could turn him one way, like, oh, this grenade is stopping it. Okay. You can, you could, you can do it. Okay. I don't want to. On some real shit, like, pow, pow, pow. Let's see. My bad, excuse me. Bad language. Some stuff like that. I'm gonna have fun posing this guy, but once I get the pose I want, he is definitely standing in that pose. But what we're gonna do right now, I'm gonna show you aerial view of the guy. Pretty dope, pretty dope. You see the tendrils. We are still gonna put him on the record. You know what I'm saying? The tendrils, the guns, you know what I mean? But we're gonna go ahead and switch views right now, y'all, right now. Let's do it.
There we go, guys. So let's go hit that exposure back up now. Because um, it's pretty dark. And we're going to put this dude right here. Oh, no, it's not. We're going to put him right there. Let me get a stand. Cutting. Sorry about the wait. Like I said, this is it's gonna have to work for some um, reason. Fit. Thing is, you gotta kind of get him to pose. There is a lot of, of joints moving, bro. Like, to get him to stand is crazy, bro. Like, really, the balance. You know what I mean? Think I got it. Mm -mm. I don't think I got it. <laughs> Thought I had it. I can see where it's not right. I'm sorry, it's just hard to pose this guy to stand him up. It is. Something to put behind. 
This is some work, bro. Okay. I give up. Well, guys, I give up. I'm going to show y'all up close to this. <laughs> it's going on a half hour video, man. I am so sorry, man. This makes no sense. But like I said, it's my first time messing with one of these guys, man. And, my, and myself, I'm getting frustrated. So, we're just going to give you the close up. Oh. This is how I have posed. I lost one of the guns just right now. It's over there somewhere, but it's okay. You can see the tendrils can hold the guns as well. You know what I mean? I mean, it's pretty dope. You know what I'm saying? Don't get it twisted. Pretty, pretty dope. You know what I mean? I really, really dig it. Um, Let's see. Go to the side. If we focus. No, we're not gonna focus. There we go. Side. Tendrils coming out his back. I'm gonna take the tendrils off too and show you. I'm kind of digging it without the tendrils a little bit. You know what I'm saying? But just to let you see. And that's that. His feet is all white as well. I see why they sell the little stands, like see those for the little holes in his feet. Cause it's very hard to get this guy to stand up. For me it is. People who've, who've had practice, I'm pretty sure they got this down pat. You know what I'm saying? But for me, no, no, no. The tendrils just come off. So it's a little hole in his back. You know, he's got all the weaponry, knife, pouch. You know, it's anti venom, bro. Super dope. But I am going to figure out stand on. He's going to stay out the box. And I'm going to figure out how to stand this guy up. One way or another. All right, y'all. This is your boy Slick50 for popping vinyl. Sorry for taking so long, man, messing with this dang on thing. But I tell you this, I'm going to get better at it because there will be more coming. All right? So y'all know what it is. This is your boy Slick50. Like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. I'm up out of here. Deuces.